This Tulsa man was released from a California jail, even though he has felony warrants here. I'm Shay Rossi. And I'm Sarah Whaley. Thanks so much for joining us. We told you Christopher Bartley was arrested in California with a Tulsa teen in late July after failing to appear on charges here involving that very same teen. It's quite a story. New at 9, Fox 23's John Asibas has been following this story. John, so was he supposed to be released? Well, you'll remember I'm actually standing outside of one of the Tulsa Police Divisions. A few weeks ago, they posted on Facebook about his arrest in California and that he would soon be extradited back to Oklahoma. So to answer your question, the district attorney here in Tulsa County says no, he was not supposed to re be released. Had a bench warrant out for failing to appear in court involving charges with the same child here in Oklahoma. They want to know where Christopher Bartley is. So do I. We both reached out to the Orange County District Attorney's Office for a response. Christopher Bartley should not be a free man, according to District Attorney Steve Coonsweiler. The most, the thing that's most disappointing to me is that we had a warrant after his arrest with a request to ex extradite him back to Oklahoma. He just walked out of their jail, and, and I don't have an answer for that. Bartley pled guilty to having sex with someone under 18, plus a second sex-related charge. Within short order, they pled him out to what appears to be misdemeanor crime. Bartley was arrested in late July, was convicted and sentenced this week to 42 days and a year probation. Booking records show he was released from the Central Women's Jail in Orange County on August 17th for credit for time served. 42 days in jail. I'm doing the math. I'm not saying 42 days there. Uh, so yeah, if they would have held him for each day that he was ordered to serve, you would have thought he'd still be out in their jail. I want to find out from their prosecutors what happened. I did too. I emailed four of the public defenders listed on his case and left messages to the district attorney's office asking why he was released and not held on his warrant here for not showing up to court on charges related to running off with the same Tulsa team. I don't know how that would not have been picked up in the California jail. They may have a totally different protocol. Maybe they just want to get their people out of jail and they don't want to check on whether other states have a desire to hold them accountable. For now, he just hopes an officer somewhere finds him again. None of those public defenders ever got back to me, and I've actually reached out to the DA's office, left a message with a receptionist and also some voicemails just asking for status updates on his court proceedings. I've never gotten a call or an email back. I also asked why it was listed that he was in a central woman's jail. When we get those answers and any responses, we'll make sure to provide those here on Fox 23 News. Covering news that matters, I'm John Asibas, Fox 23 News.